assalamu alaikum welcome to my channel this is my second video related to spiral stair for autocad beginners so let's start first we will draw circle with 150 units again i will draw another circle with 15 unit i'll just take one line join it there then i will array this line color here go to the items i need item 15 numbers and fill with 270 degree so enter String this as well as this also. It's one array, so I'll explode that. Okay, I'll move this one. and make it as a boundary move the boundary no need for that one line in the middle and just draw one circle nearby with the 1.2 unit also delete this line now I will again draw one more circle the same which is 15 unit circle I will write again now I will extrude this with 20 unit go back to 2D wireframe now array this again color with this base point again go back to 15 unit here 270 enter enter again just explode that okay now what we have to do we will move each portion and place it on another one with the base point like this This is the last one. Now, now I'll extrude at circle. Just click here. Now this small circle we need to copy no need for the first one now here we have one line it's called SPL so just select the center start from there then continue to all these circles click in the middle
enter after the last point okay now we will copy this line with the base point and here I want to copy it to the z direction so I'll just type 0 comma 0 comma 50 enter and again 0 comma 0 comma 100 so I need two time copy enter this is the copied line now the down one I don't need I'll delete that one here these circles which we have also we need to extrude that with the 100 unit and I will draw it there is one circle with the 1.2 unit just copy and we will sweep this one circle to the one copied line and another one to another copied line now, this is the handrail for the stairs if we see in elastic mode we see there is some gaps in there so to fill that gap very simple just go back to the wireframe and draw one spare Click the center with 1.5 unit and copy the same with the base point here I also trace the base point that middle yeah. now again go back to the elastic view yes So we can see that this gap has been filled okay now what we have to do just to make this one as union enter And also we need to make union for all these stairs. Okay, now move that handrail with the base point and just paste it here. Yeah. So the stairs are ready you go to the realistic view now the last one is material lab just type MIT here I'll go here with the wood so the handrail and here for the stairs I will go to the concrete for instead of concrete I will go to stone yeah 
it's up to you which color which design you want accordingly you can choose any one so i hope you like this video if you like please subscribe my channel for more autocad tutorials thank you